Hey guys, Renee from Bergen Hunter Thrift Store here. Remember those 25,000 action figures, 30,000 Hot Wheels? Plus we had all those records? Well, we finally priced the records. I actually think there's more than 3,000 records. I've been pricing all day today and we only got half of it done. We had four people working on it. We're gonna do the other half tomorrow and then uh, I'm gonna show you, which we're gonna do a time warp in just a second. We're gonna show you some of the records. I think actually this was just a bonus to the toy deal, but this might've been one of the best record collections ever. Not because it has a whole bunch of rare and weird stuff, but every record is like Pink Floyd, Rolling Stone, Bee Gees, Journey. It's I mean, pretty much 90% of the record collection. It's all classic rock. Let's go take a look. You know, I tell you young people all the time, work hard, you're gonna get there. Yesterday was my day off. I was here from six till midnight and I sleeved all this stuff. So everything on top here, it's sleeved. I'll have Casey and Tatiana coming and probably Cheryl too. And they're gonna price it. So everything on top here, and it's separated with price. So everything there will be $9.99. And everything over here will be $14.99. So it's separated. And then everything on top of right here will be $19.99. Then you'll see all those boxes beneath. Those are all new. We did those on Monday, which was a day we were open. So we just we did those. So all these will be brand new. We just took off the sheets for tomorrow's release. These boxes on top of here, these are leftovers from the last sale. It's about 2000 But I think last time we put out another four, 5000 plus we had stuff. So we actually been selling records like crazy. Then I got on top of the table right here stuff that I separated, like this whole pile is Elvis. All this is Rolling Stones. See how much. All this is Led Zeppelin. Um, all this is Pink Floyd. Lots of Dark Side of the Moon and Wall. Doors, Who, Monkeys, Beach Boys. So most of those are like 20, 30, some even 40. I found a nice $200 record yesterday too, a nice jazz record. All this is Beatles. Yep. And then all this is stuff, so I'm gonna go through right now, but it's like, there's a few Bob Marley, ACDC, what else do we see? Oh, these two piles of misc, um, miscellaneous Aerosmith. There's a Fleetwood Mac Live, we have lots of Fleetwood Mac stuff. So um, I'm gonna price this stuff, and then I'm gonna come back and show you guys the final product. Hi Tiffany, this is Tatiana from Bargain Hunters Thrift Store in Poway. You're on our records VIP list. We have 4,000 records coming out tomorrow, the 23rd of July. 80% of our collection is classic rock with punk, 80s, and jazz mixed in. Our new hours are 11 to 7 and we're closed on Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Thank you. Have a great day. We can't wait to see you. Say hi to YouTube. Oh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> Tatiana has called like a hundred people. She's been repeating the same message or talked to them directly like a hundred times. So we're finishing off probably, I don't know, it's another hour or two, probably two more hours. But we're all getting to the same pace, so almost there. I'm going to show you guys. All right, guys, this day is taking longer than expected. You can say that again. But Casey, Tatiana, myself, we're pricing. We're trying to get these records ready. I will give you a tour of some of the boxes in a minute. But I'm going to show you guys something right now. Remember, I showed all the autographed stuff. So here I found another one, Moody Blues, signed by the band. And then this is stuff that I'm going to take home for eBay. I haven't looked this up yet, but Talking Hands, Speaking in Tongues. But it's a special clear vinyl. Bruce Springsteen on the edge. It's a promo. Blind Faith, Eric Clapton. I don't know. Oh, that's because that's like the new cover. Uh, the Jets, like I, I pulled this before, I forgot why, but I just put it so I couldn't find it. Pac Man picture disc, super cool. It's like yeah, 90, it's really cool. 90 bucks on eBay. Uncle Remus, 50, 60 bucks on eBay. I couldn't find this, even on Discogs, I couldn't find this um, uh, album. I sick anticipated. But the other stuff was high. Another Uncle Remus. And then everything you've seen here, this whole box right here, it's all brand new seal. That's the main stuff I usually keep. Is, Prepare, I'll move a couple out so you guys can see some. Let's just see what this is. Abba. This is all brand new seal stuff. Except this right here, this Star Wars picture disc. But, um, yeah, everything. Sure, very good. Brand new sealed. Pretty much anything, like a virgin. Anything brand new sealed is usually at least 20 bucks. Sometimes it might take a little bit longer to sell, but it sells. Elvis number one hits. Just kind of going fast. Paul Simon, Silk, Pat Panadar, Star Trek, brand new sealed. 
Janet Jackson, Rhythm Nation. Casey loves her. Mm, that was a good concert. Twilight of Honor. Now the Elvis brand new sealed. Judas Priest. Oh, that one's not brand new sealed. Let me, uh, I'm gonna price that. Probably 15, 20 bucks. This is, we have the technology. Yes, huh. we do. Lita Ford, Ray Stevens. MASH, that's probably good. Some mask, MASH collection. This is a sealed. Uh, yep, a little, it's coming apart, but sealed. Madonna again, Temptations. Pet Shop Boys brand on seal, that should be good. Even that label, Celsius, so this is probably a German name. This is probably import. But it says EMI America, so eh, maybe. Sound of German. Air Supply, Disney, Toto, Wang, Paul Anka, Elton John, Richie Havens, Duke Ellington, Medusa, James Gang. Oh, here, check this. This one is not sealed, but it's uh, Elton John Single Man picture disc. Actually, I probably can just price it here. Oh, actually, no, it's brand new sealed. Yeah, we'll take it. Beach Boys, brand new sealed. So, like, I got probably like four or five hundred of these uh, brand new sealed records, and eventually we'll list all on eBay. Actually, now's a good time because records are doing pretty well. And then I couldn't find this one quick, so um, I just didn't do more research. I have to do more research on this, but Yak Panzer. Looks like some kind of rare heavy metal stuff. This actually looks like it's signed over here. Oh, actually, you know what? It's signed. Huh. Signed here. Can you guys see it? Signed. Oh, yeah. With a pen. It took a bad head, but still. But it's, it's a pretty cool picture disc. I mean, the artwork by itself is pretty badass. Except the girl's face looks kind of ugly. <laughs> but I don't know. It's pretty cool. But, um, pretty cool artwork. So... I'm gonna move this box, we're gonna sleeve up the rest, and then I'm gonna give you a tour, show you some of the high-end records. This is like an unbelievable collection. Hey you! Yeah, you! I hope you're enjoying the video. Don't forget to subscribe and smash the like button down below. All right, guys. Everything bad I said about Cheryl early in the video, I have to take back now, because she just showed up. I'm just kidding, I didn't say nothing bad, except maybe a five minute rant, but that's Max. <laughs> <laughs> Careful. Oh. All right, let me show these videos. So guys, so I'm gonna show you this section right here. It's mostly stuff that's 30 bucks and above. But I mean, that's like, and some of it, you know, you can get the same prices on eBay and like hardcore collectors have it, but that's not really my target audience. We get all the young people coming in or people that are just rebuying their childhood. And look how many copies of Beach Boys. So this is all Beach Boys. Spirit of America. Surfer girl. Beach Boys, Beach Boys, Beach Boys. Like, it's just amazing how much good stuff we got of this. Yeah, you trying to get by? Yeah. You can come by. I don't want to make, like, so much money. It's okay. Monkeys. Headquarters. The Monkeys. Some of these are 20. Most of the stuff is 20 or more. And, you know, with the records, I always get people, Oh, my God, Renner, your prices are high in Michigan. I'll buy it for a dollar. It's like, guys, last time we had, like, over 6,000 records in the store. We had, like, less than 3,000 or maybe probably maybe even 2,000. Hendrix, Sabbath. So this stuff sells, like, I mean, everything here is, like, you can just see Sabbath, Sabbath, Hendrix, a couple of those. And just to sum up what we have, 80% of our collection... Stop it. I already videotaped you earlier. Oh, you did? Yeah, I videotaped you. Oh. You still remember you were laughing? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I was just going to say... So this is an album. That's my most expensive Elton John album we usually have. But all the kids love buying that one. Then, of course, Queen. This stuff, like, we put 30 bucks on. Oh, this is um, a special color vinyl disc. Garcia. This is all Grateful Dead stuff back here. Elton John. Queen. Queen. Then right here, check this box out. So I'm showing you a little bit more on this one because there's just more stuff here. Stones. This is all stones. 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 Everything here. Text 
on so I can show you a little bit better. They're all stones. Mick Jagger. Some girls. Wait till you guys see the next box. It's all stones and then stones, stones, Def Leppard, Def Leppard. Oh, here's a couple Def Leppard. Ooh, my favorite. I don't know, he's a bunch of Who and Tommy. Who's next? Tommy, Tommy, Tommy. Uh, this is Steve. Oh, here, Rocky Horror Picture Show. So Casey was just telling us a story. Apparently when she was 16, she snuck out of the house to go see this movie with her friends. Coworkers. Coworkers. And her mom doesn't know, so I'm going to tell her. No, That's a good way to see if your mom watches our videos. She says she does, but not always. It's all eagles right here. Okay. Pink Floyd. Dark Side of the Moon. We have 50 bucks on this, okay? But it's Harvest First Pressing. And not only do we have one, we got one, two. I, I, I never even get these in collections. Three, four... Five. Five Pink Floyds. Here's more Pink Floyd stuff. Wish You Were Here. Awesome song. Pink Floyd. Pink Floyd. I think this is Animals, right? Or something like that. And then all these. I put 40 because every kid asks, do you have Pink Floyd at the wall? Off the, the wall? Here we got one, two, three, four, five, six times. Then a bunch of Led Zeppelin. With the bag. Right here. That's Zeppelin. This is a super popular album. Every time I put 29 bucks, it sells. And I have it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven times. But I think there's more. Here's some more back here. I think we had like 13 or 14 copies. Here's Let Zeppelin 2. Again, several times. Soundtrack Let Zeppelin. Whole bunch of these or maybe this one we have 13 times i don't know uh, here's more this whole box is let's zeppelin through oh no here's alice cooper crosby woodstock then here almost this entire box is beatles probably my best selling album if i get it that and the white album abbey road so and you know we get those prices i mean they don't sell like immediately, but they sell. Oh, those are albums everybody wants to buy. Rubber Soul. And most of these are all pretty nice condition, actually. And this goes all the way. Beatles Rarities. Let It Be. Meet the Beatles. White album with serial number. But it's the stereo version. Butcher cover, but it's not. So. Mystery Tours. George Harrison. This is a bunch of George Harrison stuff. There's a bunch of McCartney stuff coming. Then this album right here, we put 20 bucks on it. I mean, I was used to sell it for 30, but I got like 10 copies of it. Wings. Oh, I got a bunch of Kiss. Kiss, Kiss, Kiss. So I'm kind of doing it fast. I'm not showing you guys everything. Double Platinum. These always sell fast. People just buy these for the artwork. Dynasty Asylum. Okay, and then in here we got all kinds of classic rock. So we got Elvis, which pretty much any Elvis will put 30 bucks on people buy them. Then we have a bunch of the doors in here. More Elvis, Elvis, Elvis. More and more Elvis. Doors. Doors, doors, doors. UB40, that's an interesting one. 20 bucks. Cars, Stevie Wonder. Oh, this one I got wrong. The King um, Crimson, I think. Best of the Animals, Temptations, Story of Star Wars. I got a bunch of Star Wars. Shows. Oh, here's Arithmus Life, Casey. We got a bunch of Fleetwood Mac, Fleetwood Mac Life, Van Halen. This is cool. Transformers. Oops. Hopefully it's still recording. Transformers. 
Miles Davis, Bitches Brew, Empire Strikes Back, Dylan and the Grateful Dead, that's probably a really cool album. I couldn't find this anywhere, I quick look, but it's a picture of this, so, well actually it's, I don't know, it's interesting. And then The Clash, Raggedy Ann, Anthology, not a Star Wars, Fleetwood Mac. Oh, this is cool right here. Modern Jazz Quartet. Here's the last. All right, I'm gonna clean All this up. All these are new it. records. There is um, 21 across, and then another, I think that's 15 or 16 right here. And you know, um, Culture Club, 80 stuff sells really well in our store. Dylan. I mean, everything in this collection, George Benson, Funny Girl. These are actually some of the 9.99 ones. Doctor Hook, awesome. Steely Dan, Prince with lots of Prince stuff in here. Crosby, Stills, and Nash. I have this album like probably 20 times in here. That's why it's only 15 bucks. Lou Reed, David Bowie, a lot of David Bowie stuff. King Crimson again. Papas and the Mamas. Freedom. Foreigner. Super Tramp. Talking Heads. Yeah, there's a bunch of that purple rain, bunch of this purple rain stuff. We put twenty bucks that will sell fast. Elton John greatest hits. Pretty much anything created hit greatest hits we usually get twenty bucks for. Stevie Nicks, because people will pick it up that wanna don't want to buy a bunch of albums, they just want to buy the greatest hits. We have a lot of Tom Petty stuff. Here's another credence. Oh, here's somebody just sent me a message, dismiss. Van Morris and Moon Dance. You see another purple rain. Bee Gees first. This is cool. This is actually a color disc, too. I think it was red. Jazz at, Jazz at the Black Hog. Charlie Prawn, Peter Paul and Mary. King Kong. Tomcat. Streets of Fire soundtrack. Cool art. I mean, there's so much. Like, I'm getting tired, to be honest. Just trying to put a 20 minute video quick to get a quiet riot. And I know it, I'm gonna keep the show at a bunch of years because they're like, Renee, keep it long, it shows every album. But last time I didn't get that much thumbs up, so now we're just kind of doing it a little bit quicker. Remember, if you guys like something, thumbs it up, leave a comment, tell us what you like, how you like it. If you love the channel, show the support. Also, to the people that sign up for the $100,000 giveaway, I'm probably gonna play the on, on day two. So, the day, day two, number one, so I'm gonna probably play Saturday. The poker, they know. Talking Heads. Barbara Streisand, Steely Dan. I mean, almost everything in here is classic rock. This is cool. I saw him live in concerts. One of the best concerts I've ever seen. BB King. Neil Diamond. Oh, Journey. Actually, this is probably the best concert I've ever seen. Super Tramp Paris. Whole bunch of Santana. Bob Seger. I mean, it just keeps on going and going. Band on the Run. A lot of Loggins, Messina, History of Wreck and Roll, Aretha. Oh, Aretha, Life at the Fillmore. That's probably a kill album. Elton John and Australia Life. That's a really nice album. Skinner, Banana Rama, Moody Blues. So you can see, like, everything is just uh, quality here. Elton John. And, you know, some of the hardcore collectors sometimes say, Renee, it's like everybody has let us get it, but that's not my target audience. My target audience is people that are getting into stuff now, and that's what they want. They want all these, you know, dire straits, not a banana rama. Our target audience is people who pay for the rest. <laughs> that's true. With lots of Johnny Cash stuff, like all the Johnny Cash stuff. I mean, we pretty much put 20 bucks on any of it, but it sells right away. So, like stuff like this, I did uh, Hymns from the Hard, 15 bucks. Steve Martin, there you go. Marshall Tucker, Leonard Skinner, Sounds of Success, that's a Padre thing. More Dylan, Uriah Heep, Chicago, Moody Blues, lots of Madonna stuff. More Van Morrison. Duran Duran, Cat Stevens. I mean, you can almost pull out any record, it's gonna be good. Tower of Power. Super Tramp, Life in Paris, Van Halen, Bruce Springsteen, like these would put 20 on, which normally is anyway, but I have a lot of them, but the reason that movie came out, so a lot of people asked us for that, um, 
What's this? Oh, you know, some kind of rock. Association Chicago, Almond Products, Mamas and the Papas, Culture Club again. Streisand. Oh, we got a lot of Michael Jackson in there too. So we got the Thriller album, the Bad album. Here's the Thriller. People were paying a hundred bucks an album when he passed away, not knowing that they made millions and millions of this. Here's a good one. Johnny Cash, St. Quentin. That's a really good album. Super Trap, Alice Cooper. I think you guys get the drifts. Donald Fagan, it's actually a good album. Hit Jack with Fall. It's actually a good deal at 20 bucks. Eric Clapton, Slow Hand, Madonna. Then we got some Broadway stuff, you know, DeWiss. People come in looking for that. Jim Croce, a bunch of his stuff. Again, Kratos his out hits album, 20 bucks. Any Fleetwood Mac is pretty much 20 bucks. Clash, Combat Rock, that's punk. Jim Croce, Willie Nelson, Devo, Leonard Skinner, Police, Not a Thriller. Harry Clapton at its best. Men at Work. And it keeps on going. I mean, just the top. Neil Diamond, that's probably one of my most less. Um, here's a Lindsay Buckingham, or Buckingham and Knicks. Talking Heads. But I do have Lindsay Buckingham solo albums too. You guys know he passed away, I'm sure. Journey, Tom Petty, Steve Miliband, Diana Ross. Uh, Simple Minds, Dire Straits, Sting. And we didn't place these on top or anything. I mean, this is just what happens. Oh, this is just what happens to be there. Billy Joel. Uh, what's this? I don't know him. Tommy Ballin. I don't know. Broadway guitar. So that's like, so we have very few records at five bucks. So that's a $5 record. Actually, you know, I think a couple of these boxes might have been leftovers. Genesis. Yeah, I think these three boxes are leftovers. Ray Charles. Willie Nelson, Deep Purple, Burn. Atlanta Rhythm Section for you guys that follow my dad. So he actually plays with the guy that was the lead singer for them at one. Linda Ron said Los Lopos, Grease. More Steely Dan, more Fleetwood Mac, more Aerosmith, Close Encounters, Barbara Streisand, Cheap Trick, All Shook Up.